what can you do at the library? I write this question down on the board with my students, then I ask them to write down the answer. I ask them, do you think this is an easy question? And they usually say yes. And most of them usually get it wrong. If I ask you, what can you do at the library? A lot of my students will write, I can study, I can read books, um, I can find information, and this is wrong. What you should say is, you can, read at, uh, you can read at the library, you can read books, you can find information. What can you do at the library? You can read books. So, students are like, what? You have a question with you and the answer with you? That makes no sense. It does in English, unfortunately. What you means is it's a general uh, idea. It just means everybody. What can everybody do at the, at the library? That's what it means. It's not an individual question about you. Let's say, for example, if I were smoking a cigarette in the library, and the security guard walks up and says, Hey, you can't smoke here. Would I say, Oh, is it, is it, it's, I can't smoke? Oh, what about my friend? Is it okay for him? No, he doesn't mean you can't smoke here, Marcus. He means everybody. So, in English, you means everybody. Right? If I say, um, can you drink? Some countries you can drink uh, alcohol on the street. Can you drink alcohol on the street in your country? And if you say, yes, I can, it means only you, only you can do it, and nobody else can because you have special privileges, which is crazy. Right? Can you drink on the street in your country? Yes, you can. Everybody can do it. If I ask you, uh, you know, what, sh what should you do to uh, make a woman happy? And a lot of students would, would use I. But this is a general question. It should be, what should you do to make a woman happy? You should bring her flowers. Uh, you should write her poetry. Or you should um, uh, tell her nice things. Right, so the, again, the answer is going to be you, you. So students usually get that wrong. Now, students are going to ask, "Well, how how will I know when someone asks me a question about myself versus a general question?" And you you really you have to pay attention. You know, I I would never ask you what can you do at the library because, um, unless of course your father were the president of the library and you had special privileges, but it's just a general question. So, watch out for that. For exercise based on my video lessons, check out greenscreen.com. Oh, Late.